smells good that. Tastes good. I'm going to bed fine. <laughs> <laughs> Ant and you are watching Survive the Night and in this episode it's another wet one it was meant to be absolutely cracking the flags again but uh, hence it's chucking it down so I've managed to uh, string up the tarp this is what I'm sleeping under tonight and uh, hopefully um, on dry earth I got the uh, I got the tarp up just before the heavy rainfall came in so I think we'll be okay uh, as I say it is literally just me under the tarp I've got uh, a little reflective cover that's going to go down and then I'm in my uh, my bivy bag as well so uh, yeah roughing it tonight we're out in a beautiful beautiful coastal lo location so uh, yeah I'm going to uh, take you guys down onto the uh, the beachfront and have a look at the scene in a little bit but yeah hopefully fingers crossed this just passes over So I know that is really annoying, it's the, it's the most annoying sound that you could possibly have on a wild camp, couldn't you? Nice and peaceful and quiet and then you crank up that. So yeah, there is a reason for it. The last, uh, well, couple of videos back, I did promise that I would give away one of these pumps, one of these uh, electric pumps, that was very kindly donated to the channel by Gary. So thank you once again, Gary, for it. Um, it came in the post a uh, good couple of weeks ago now and I've not um, I've not opened it. Now Gary says it's not exactly the same as this but it is the same principle um, as this, this pump. So I'm going to be giving that away uh, later on in the video. So stay tuned, maybe it's your name that gets called out. Oh, 
That was cool, huh? So we are on tonight. Oh, I picked the wrong one up. I thought we was on chicken uh, casserole, but we're on. Look what we found, chili con carne. And I'm trying to go all hog healthy. So I brought chickpeas instead of uh, instead of rice. I'm trying to keep away from the cans so we've got the, the cardboard option. So hopefully we can get that in burn that as well. Nothing wrong with that. Hmm. That's hot. I won't say the look what we found chili con carne is as good as my chili, but it's not bad. <laughs> and I'm absolutely starving, so we've all got black tops. Yeah, it's not like uh, bird's nests, yeah. but for like giant <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful spot to uh, spend an evening. You can't beat it. The wind is coming straight over us though and hitting camp. It's not too bad, but it's uh, you can see why there's windmills out there. But what a fantastic place. We're in uh, July now, the 1st of July today. And uh, yeah, the summer is well and truly upon us. It's not been that great. It's been a little bit damp as you've seen on the camps that we've done, but we're out, we're out doing it. Right, as you can see, the night is drawing in now. We're looking at around about, I'd say about half nine, something like that. And we've retired under Chris's tarp. We did have Leon's just down at the bottom there, but as the wind was coming over this little uh, hill, this little mound here where we pitched, um, it kind of whipped up underneath it. So we, we took that down. We didn't want to risk a, a fire on the, uh, on the firebox. So uh, yeah, we're under here, nice and cozy and we're going to see the night out with a couple of cans of beer and a good laugh. We'll see Absolutely. you in a bit.
Well, morning everybody and welcome to a beautiful <laughs> wet Saturday morning uh, yeah all night long it pretty much tippled down and the tarp I know no needs to have a, a full seam seal right across the, uh, the the center section because if I didn't have the bivy bag I would have been wet through it literally just came tippling in um, I did move along a little bit towards the front the way i'd set it up it wasn't too bad because the rain was coming off uh, and down the back so it was all right but uh as you've seen this morning i've made my breakfast and it was literally tippling it down all the way through that so i've had to bring the the bush box just under the tarp and i don't like doing that because you never know a couple of sparks go up and and that's your tarp gone but Thankfully it was okay and I managed to cook the breakfast. We had an all day breakfast there. And uh, yeah, just still on with my uh, my first brew. So this is the view. This is what we're looking at today. It's not too bad, it's breaking. So it looks as though the, uh, the tide's going out now and hopefully taking the bad weather with it, but we'll see. But yeah, it's, uh, it, lo it is looking brighter. So we'll get down there, we'll see what the lads are up to and uh, start packing up. Right, we have come to the end of the video. Everybody's packed up, Leon beats us all. He's just literally like lightning putting that jacket up now and taking it down, so yeah. Um, I wanna say thank you to these guys once again for coming out with us and uh, what a fantastic camp it's been. Very diverse in weather-wise, conditions have been pretty terrible aren't they you know what I mean all night long raining but we've had a few malfunctions which will uh, probably let you guys know uh, on social media so what happened but I just want to say thank you so much for um, watching the video hope you guys have enjoyed it and if you possibly think about subscribing and if you could like this video it really does help me out but what really helps the channel out if you could possibly share this video that would be great uh, the link to Chris's channel, MCM Outdoors, will be on the uh, in the description below. So head over to the channel there. Leon has got an Instagram page. If you head over to Leon, Leon Constantine, is that it? Constantine, Constantine. Hi. Yeah. So head over to uh, both the, the the channels and uh, give them a give them a like. Have a look at their content as well. And it just leads me to say uh, to the, announce the winner of the pump. I want to give the pump over to Kath, she is absolutely fantastic, she um, comments and it's not just one comment per video, we have a conversation and it's just, it, she really is interacting with the uh, the channel so thank you so much Kath, pop your, uh, your address and where, where can we send it, send me an email, my email's in the description, send me an email with your uh, address on it and I'll get that pump out to you. So once again, thanks a lot and thanks to these two and we'll see you on the next one. Take it easy, bye. I want to say hello and a big shout out to Rick and his girlfriend Sarah. They uh, watch my videos, we've been friends with Rick, me and Leon for uh, a good probably 10 years plus and he's over in America. So uh, him and his girlfriend really do enjoy watching the outdoor videos that we do. So I just want to say hello to you pal and uh, and to Sarah and I hope you guys are doing okay I'll speak to you soon